Okay, welcome back. We are here. It is Tuesday, uh, Monday, November 6th, and we are ready to begin our lift path. We're going to make it nice and simple today. We're just going to use tubing. That's it. We're going to keep ourselves off of the ground because it will be a little chilly. So um, we're going to start with our tubing, fold it in half. We've got some tension on it at all times. That's going to keep the muscles engaged. We've got nice tight tummies. Toes and heels out, belly button tight, lock knees, let's take a breath. And that's how we go, deep breath. Ah, so nice, deep breath. And give me one more try, deep breath. And then both hands to our thighs, please, round up. And let's match. I'll go roll it up. And down we go, tie again, round up. And back down, we've got two more times, round up. And back down, now this time, let's go slowly up, please, for four and three. And two, let's take another breath in. Now arms halfway down, let's march in place. Keep going, four. Three, we'll add some step touch to the left and the right. Now let's add some pumping arms, little push. A little bit higher. A little bit higher. A little bit lower. Now in front. Two steps to the left, and two to our right. Left again, then right, and left, and right. Return to step five, and swing it out. Good, now kick back, and then toe tap. Very good, add a nice, easy twist. While we twist, we'll throw in some lunges. Nice big rainbows up there. Now return to our fist. How about figure eights right here, please? Give me one, two, and then let's go backwards with these. Two, back to the fist. And let's do a small pulse pull left this time. Four. Three, and then let's turn to face that left leg. Heel and arms together lifting, high and low. And then just drop the back knee for me. So let's lift and drop. Final two. One more, stay dropped. And do a little pulse right here for four. Three, now no pulse, just pull on the two bank for the pulse. For four, three, two, we're gonna hold there. And then push the back heel down. From there, sit back with front toes, stretch, hold it, and then just press your toes down up. Let's press and lift, press and lift. Last two, and one more to go. Keep the toes pressed all the way down, try to sink a little deeper. Then let's all face front and slowly roll up. Another breath overhead. Good. Marching place this time, right left. Now we're gonna add that step touch. Good, now add some arms, a little push ball. And we go a little higher. And then way up high. Lower. And back to the front. Very good. Now it's two steps to the right. And two to your left. Right again. And left. One more set, go right. Now just do step touch and add the spin. And our kick back. And our toe tap. Good. Twist. While we twist, let's lunge. Now cross it down up. And lift. Now stay overhead. Nice big rainbow, please. And then twist again. Good. Now we're going to draw figure eight. Really great one to warm up the torso. Now the other way. Woo. Back to swing. Now let's twist. While we twist, draw in those lunges. Right this time, four. Let's go through the face, right 
One more time. Very good. All right, so now let's take both handles. Take your feet about hip distance. Toes in, heels out, elbows bend. We're going to open the door. So we're going to open and close. Working on that rotator. Good. Now let's try up in the tempo. Open and close the door. Here's our six. Here we go. And two. And one more. Good job. Okay, arms go straight. Let's go ahead and drop the left handle. Still holding the right handle. Good posture. Toes and heels out. Belly button nice and tight. Slow side raise. Really done. Two more. So we're looking for shoulder level. Nothing above that. But we're not worried if we take it all the way up there. And then do the exact same thing. Front nice and long. And down. Exhale, lift. Inhale, down. Two more. Exhale, lift. One more slow one. Now let's try upping the tempo to the side, please. Four. Three. And then same thing, but front, 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 front. Good. Now let's try two times side. Left side, left front. 
Do right side right front again. And then left side left front. Now let's do right side left front. And then right front left side. Good, do right side left front again. And then right front and left side. Same arm combo. Slow it together. Bend your elbows, palms face in. Let's open and close the door slowly. Out. And. Woo, opening that door and closing the door. Now let's try it up tempo. One. And two. Now the last four like this. Last two. And one more to go. Very good. So now let's. Straighten the arms, bend your knees a little bit. Hinge forward, belly button tight, arms long, elbows soft, slow reverse fly. Out, up, down, please. Exhale on the way up. Inhale on the way down. Always some degree of tension on the two big. One more slow one. Still up that tempo, please. One. Good, now just the left arm. And the right arm. Together. Together slowly. And again. One more time. Good job, now let's straighten up. Slow up, right row, up, up, down, down. Now up in the tempo. Woo, keep at it, we've got six. Four to go. And two. And one more. Good, good. Move then, let's hinge. Arms on the elbows, soft. Slow reverse slide. Woo! And again. And upping that tempo. Targeting rear delts on me. Should not be feeling this in your neck or your low back. Now just the right arm, too. One more. Very good. Now let's try that. Ooh, nice work. All right, let's do a little shoulder stretch. Ah, left arm touches our heart. Same goes to the right. Ah. Both arms front. Nice stretch to the rear duck. Hands together behind us. Pull down. Let's do it. Ah. Nice stretch for the front shoulder. And let's release a couple shoulder rolls back on. Well done. All right. Let's move back to some lower body. For this one, we're going to use our tubing and just simply feed one handle to the other. So we form a nice little loop and then you're going to place it around your left ankle. Tighten it up for me. And then when you're ready, you're going to stand on it with your right foot. So we're going to maintain balance, which requires a good strong core. Focal point for your eyes, belly button tight internal rotation so that when we're lifting our leg, we're targeting that abductor out in. Two. Four to go. Now a little pulse out. Four. Three. Four slow. Four. One more time. Four. Three. Four. Slow. 
fourth glove. Now pulse up four, four, three, two. Let's set your foot down. We'll squat lift. Now every time we lift, we're gonna open the leg out. Four to go. Last two. Good, now just your squat. Give me four. Three. And this time, squat and lift up. Four. Good, now just do two squats. Squat, lift that leg for two. Two more squats. And squat, lift that leg for two. Now little pulse, squat, little pulse. How about four, three, two, we're gonna hold there. Good, now slowly rise up. Very nice, once we're up, we're gonna take that same leg but bring it behind us. So again, we're balancing, belly button nice and tight. Do a slow ham curl back there. Up and down. Two to go. One more. Now let's do a little up to tempo. Up and down. Two. Now we're going to pulse them for three. Three, two, extend down and again. Three, two, and again. One more time. Now just two singles. Pulse up for three, three, two, and one more. Two more singles. Pulsing up there for three, two, and just one more. Three, two, one, extend. Let's set the foot down. Just do a nice little squat because it'll feel good. Good, and then while we're down there, we're going to loosen the loop from our ankle. Put it on the other foot. All right, once that's done, you know what to do. We're stepping on it with our left foot this time. Got our good posture, belly button tight, focal point for the eyes, internal rotation. So we're gonna lift that right leg to the side. Four to go. And two. Now we're gonna pulse it out there for eight. And six. How about four? Slow. Three, two, pulse it four. Woo, four more slow. And pulse it four again. Here's our four. Three, two, let's set your foot down. Very good. Now we're going to squat and lift the leg out. There's eight. Seven. Six, four to go. And two, and one more. Now just do four squats. And two, and one. Squat like this four. Whoop. Squat two. Squat like this two. Whoop. Two more squats. Squat leg lift two. Now just do pulsing squats, little pulse. So you've got four, three, two. Now rise up slowly. Very good one to rock. Take that same leg behind you. So still working on foundational core. Slow hand pull. Extend. One more slow one. Now let's up the tempo singles. Two. Good. Now we're going to pulse it up for three, two, done. Two to 
we go. Two singles. Pulse up. And one more. Here's our last two singles. Pulsing up for three, two, last one. Three, two, one. Extend. Good job. Squat. Woo, last two. And one more. Good job, guys. All right, so now let's just take that right heel out and kind of reach and reach your toes. Good stretch of that hamstring. While you're down there, just remove the loop. And then come on up and let's take that same leg, cross it over your standing leg like the number four. A little bend, a little press on that inner thigh to open that outer hip. And then back up to a switch, other heel forward so you can reach your toes. And then come back up, crossing over like the number four. A little bend, pressing gently on that inner thigh. Very nice. All right, come on back up. Once we're up, we're going to take our tubing. I want you to put it behind you. So it goes right across your back where your bra band crosses your back. And we want to make sure that it's under our armpits. Okay, so once we got that, then the elbow come around, grab some of the tubing so you're just simply choking up and facing other side. All right, now your elbows, check them out. They're 90 degrees. They're shoulder rubber the whole time, so we're not letting them lower. We're keeping them lifted. Lift your straight palms face down. We're going to do a slow chest clap. So we're going to press forward and then pull in. So think about when you do a push up. Always maintaining tension on the tubing. Try two more slow ones. Excellent. One more to go. Now let's go a little bit when you please. That's one. And two. Three. Four more. And two. And now just left arm only, two of them. Together for two. Woo! Right arm for two. Together two. Last two. And one more to go. Good job. Now let's bend the elbows. Ah, let's bring them down. Now we're going to take the tubing. I want you to put it under your right foot. Keep the handle in your left hand and step your left foot back. Hinging over, support yourself on that right side. So when your arm is fully extended, there should be tension on the tubing. We're going to do a slow bent over row. So we drag up and push down. Think about your elbow gliding right along your rib cage. Just one more slow one. Now let's try upping the tempo. So we've got one, two, four to go. Now little pulse up top. 16, 14, 12, 10, 8, 6, 4, 3, Slow for four. Now pulse it up for eight. Eight. Six. Too slow. Pulse it four. Two more slow. Pulse it four. Four. Three. One big hold and release. All right, let's rise back up. Remove the tube from under your foot. Let's go ahead and put it back behind us again. So once again, it comes right across that upper back under the armpit. Bending the elbows so we can grab some tubing, making it more resistive. Elbows bent, shoulder level pumps facing down. Slowly do that chest press up front. Big exhale, 
take the feet out wider. So Tom Stacy front wrist is straight. Let's start with that slow bicep curl up. You want to check to make sure we're not flexing the wrist. And we're not holding the hand in too tightly. You want a nice relaxed grip. Now let's try it up tempo. Two. Four to go. Three. Two. Little pulse up. Now slow down to four. Now pulse to four. Four more slower. Good, and pulse again for four. Four. Three, now just do alternating left, right. Woo! about four more. Last two. And one more to go. Good job. Okay, let's release. Take a little breather. And then just take it so you're angling out from your hip. Starting slow again together. And again. Two more. One more slow one. Up in the tempo. Oh yeah. Four more. Woo! Good job now. Just pulse it up eight. Here we go. And we're ready to do slow four. Good, and then just pulse it for four. And then four slow again. And pulse four more. Four, three, two, hold it. Now alternate right left. Four, three, two, and one. Good job, take a little breather. Let's come back. So if you had a wider grip with uh, weight or wider stance, to make it narrow. Now this time, put your palms down and do that slow curl up, up. So these are just reverse curls. One more front. Now do the same thing, but open your hips. Again. Two to go. And then one more slow to the side. Now let's go to front foot up the tempo. Here again, now do the same thing. Let's go from the side. Last two. And then two times. Run. And two sides. One front, one side. Front and side. And then just alternate front. And then side. Woo, one more set, go front. And then side, last four. Three, two, one. Okay, so now make the arms long. Let's go back to our wide stance. We're going to stand nice and tall. Do a slow side bend to your left. And then back up. Slow side bend right. And up to the tie again slowly. Keep the belly button nice and tight. Working the waistline here. Now a little bit quicker. So we go side, center, side, center, side, center. Two more sets. One more set. Good, now take out the center. Go side to side. Side to side. Side of the waist, side of the waist. Four, three, two, and then add the center back in. Side, center. How about last two like that? 
and then just one more side and side. Okay, good job. So now just bend the elbows. Little bend in the knees. We're going to keep the hips forward and just rotate it the way. So we rotate and then center. Rotate right and center. Rotate left and center. Rotate right and a little bit quicker. Side, center. Rotate, center. Rotate, center. Belly button nice and tight. Exhale, inhale. Last two. And one more. Now just stay center and we can straight the legs. Good job, let's release. Woo, nice job. You didn't release the tubing. Straighten your arms out. Push out the heels of your hands. Stretch the biceps. Flash your fingers a few times. Shake it all out. Good. Now just press forward. Oh, that always feels good. Reach high. How about a tiny back then? Reach up. Let the left arm lower. Keep the right arm high. And then side stretch over. Come on back up. And again, side stretch. Now let the arms sweep forward. Reach out. Come all the way back up. And then we'll switch. Bring the right arm down and left arm high. Side stretch. And back up. Try again. Side step. Let's see. Pull. Reach out. Lift up. Good. And then both arms come down. Let's do some shoulder rolls back front. And then some bigger arm circles. And then some nice big, big arm circles. And a good stretch high overhead. Let's place our fingers together. Push our palms back up. Let your chin drop towards your chest. Bring the head back to you to let your palms press forward. Turn your palms to face you like you're hugging a big ball. You feel that really nice round here through the shoulders. Keep the belly button tight. Rotate to your left. Back to center and let's rotate. And then back to center. Let's inhale, open the arms and the heart. Pull your hands together. Woo, we made it. All right, here we go. That took care of our chisel class. Don't forget, lots of water, random acts of kindness, passing along to all living beings. Thank you for joining us. I'll be back tonight to let you know what we've got to be place tomorrow. So stay healthy, stay safe, and stay kind. See you soon.